In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to cross post to Instagram using your list perfectly. If you want to easily see what listings you have or have not already cross posted to Instagram or any platform, use your filters that are provided for you along the top of your catalog. So for instance, today I'm going to be listing to Instagram. I only want to see items in my catalog that aren't sold and they're not on Instagram. Then I will apply my filters and wait for my catalog to load in. And now I can see all of our listings that are not on Instagram. You can cross post to Instagram one item at a time or you can do it in bulk. I'm going to show you a few doing it in bulk for the purposes of this tutorial. At the top, you want to click your start selecting teal colored button with the two white arrows and then just select several items that you want to move to Instagram. I like to do all alike items just to keep my Instagram looking neat. So if I move three to five items a day, one day it will all be jeans, the next day plush. But you can do it however you want to set up your Instagram for business to look. I'm just going to select three pairs of jeans. Then I will click stop. Select Instagram on the platforms and tell this to copy. And it will start copying over an Instagram post. Very similar to how List perfectly cross posts listings and selling platforms. Now you will get a word alert for the description having eBay in it. This is simply a word alert that is put into place by list perfectly across all of your selling platforms because on Macari, on Poshmark, on Etsy, on Facebook, they don't like you to have the word eBay in your description. So this will pop up if you have your word alert turned on to let you know eBay's in your description. However, it is okay. It is 100% acceptable to have the word eBay in your Instagram description. The reason is you want to have your Instagram for business set up so that your link in your bio is your eBay store or your Poshmark closet, wherever you want folks to go to. But if you have it set to your eBay store or your Poshmark closet, you want to say in your description to purchase Click on our eBay link in our bio or click on our Poshmark closet in our bio. I always send people to eBay. That's a personal choice as well. I do clean up the description a little bit. I'll put the price down to what it would be on sale on eBay to show them that price. I usually take out any of the wording from eBay that I don't like for Instagram. Again, these are all personal preferences. You can just make this however you want it. And then you just want to double check your hashtags. Now, if when you're building your listing on List Perfectly, you're putting more than three tags or hashtags in, they'll all cross post over to Instagram. We only put three on our List Perfectly so that those cross over to Macari and Poshmark when we cross list. You can absolutely put more. In and save yourself this effort when you're cross posting to Instagram. But the most important thing is I always tell people always, always, always put your store, your branding as a hashtag. And you can see this is the hippo hut. Our flipping hippos branding is more for the reselling community. Our flipping hippos YouTube channel, our flipping hippos Instagram, our flipping hippos Facebook group. That's all meant for the reselling community. That's where we teach others how to do what we do for a living. We have thrift videos and haul videos. Those aren't things that I'm marketing towards my buyers. That's not the right audience. Anything that's for my buyers is the Hippo Hut. All of our stores on all of our selling platforms are the Hippo Hut, our business Instagram, our Pinterest Instagram, the Hippo Hut, because our audience there are buyers. So there's a specific difference and branding is super important. If you're active within the reselling community and you have a influencer presence there where you're a teacher or you show people how to resell, you want the same branding across all the platforms. And then if you are marketing your items for sale, 
you want to brand yourself across the board. So you can have two, like we have the hippo hut and flipping hippos. You want to have two separate Instagrams, two separate Pinterests, one for business, one for the reselling community. Sometimes I put a direct link in my Instagram post. Links on Instagram are not clickable, but there are folks who will copy and paste a link into a browser. And if you have your business Instagram connected to a business Facebook, your Instagram post will automatically update on Facebook and those links are clickable. The way I do that is I go back to the listing on my catalog. So right now I'm working on these democracy jeans. I simply just click the eBay in the column here where it shows me where the item's listed. So it will bring up my eBay listing. And I can go up here and copy the address from the address bar. And when I'm cleaning this up, I'll just add that direct link. So I would change the price to reflect what the sale price would be on eBay. And just kind of clean this up a little bit for posting purposes. And right here under where I have to purchase, click on our eBay link in our bio. I would say direct link and then paste that in. And folks can copy and paste that into a browser if they'd like. And when I connect our business Instagram to our business Facebook, that'll be a clickable blue hyperlink on Facebook. I would also like to add to you guys that this line right here in my Instagram to purchase, click on our eBay link in our bio is set up on list perfectly in the settings where you can change your description footers for each individual selling platform. That is a tutorial that has already been put into my list perfectly tutorial playlist. So if you don't know how to set up these footers to be individually unique on each platform, go ahead and watch that tutorial so you can have all of your different listings say different things based on what platform you're selling in. I usually add a, a lot of keywords, as many as I can. On Instagram, if you're selling on Instagram or you, you're listing here, it's not so much important how many followers you have as how great of keywords you have. So when you list something on Instagram, you could have three followers or 20,000 followers. That doesn't matter as much as having really good keywords, a great description, a good title, because folks that actually look on Instagram to shop will look based on hashtags. So they'll look for democracy jeans. They'll look for skinny jeans. They'll look for women's fashion. So learn your hashtags, use great ones. Don't forget to include your store name and cross post from most perfectly to Instagram is super easy.